A lion walks into a dentist. Sounds like the beginning of a very corny joke, but that's exactly what happened at Lansing's Potter Park Zoo today when a lioness had to be heavily sedated so that a vet could fix her aching tooth. Fox 47's Megan Heiler found out what goes into a root canal for a patient that roars. Ulana the lion is doing well, but that wasn't the case about a month ago because she needed a root canal. Vets say that just like humans, dental health is important to lions too. It really does improve their, over, their overall health of the animal by cleaning their teeth and keeping them as um, healthy as possible. But that task isn't easy. With the lion, we often have to have someone opening the mouth and then stick your arm in. That's Dr. Ronan Eustace showing me just how big the anesthesia machine and the tubes are that were used to put the lion under. He was just one of the veterinarians that assisted in Ulana's root canal, which is something that isn't uncommon in large cats. Sometimes their teeth can get a bit weaker and they can be more predisposed to being damaged. So um, they like to chew on big bones and so sometimes they'll break them when they're chewing on the bones or um, Things like that. When keepers noticed the damaged tooth, they knew that something had to be done, and it's not just a simple trip to the dentist. Just the physicality, um, you know, they, they weigh anywhere 350, 400 pounds, sometimes 500 pounds, so they're just big, you know, so it's hard to move them, um, and they're dangerous, so we have to, you know, really be aware of the safety of the staff and also the safety of the animals. Dr. Colleen Turner was called in to assist with the procedure, which is something she says she enjoys. It's really cool in working with larger animals. A lot of providers of, of supplies have come up with larger equipment for just for this purpose because some of these lion teeth, say you were working on a canine tooth on a lion, it could be six or eight inches long. Um, so that's an enormous tooth to have to, to clean the center canal out and file it. And as you can see, Ulana is doing well and she is back in her exhibit at the zoo so people can come see her whenever they want. For now, reporting from Lansing, I'm Megan Heiler, Fox 47 News. All right, Megan, thank you. Vets say the recovery time is pretty short for a procedure like this. Ulana was back in her exhibit the next day.